Welcome to Healthy G-Mom. Ooh, ooh. Welcome to Healthy G-Moms. Ah Welcome around the world. Welcome to my world. Welcome to Healthy G-Moms. Ah Welcome, you guys. Welcome back to Healthy G-Moms World. Yes, indeed. It is still Monday, 1130 4 p.m. Monday, um, what? December the 13th. Yes, indeed. I want to thank all my old subscribers. You guys make my heart happy. And my new subscribers, thank you for rolling with Healthy G Moms. I greatly appreciate you coming into my world. Yes, indeed. Well, I want to guys show you guys why I still have joy, and I'm up this late. So I've been working in my garden, you know, that's my happy space. My happy place, happy space, where I talk to myself, self-manifestations, self you know, telling myself I'm going to be bigger and better. I got great things coming my way, talking with God, and just peace, talking to my plants. Yes, I say good morning, hello. Yes, indeed, I talk to them, give them love, give them food, give them affection. Huh, happy space. But behind me, remember, I don't know if you guys seen that video. I had a delivery, a special delivery of um, an Amazon um, unboxing, right? And I unboxed this box right here. And this box by here is by Pure Garden. Pure Garden. I got a greenhouse, but I couldn't pick it up, put it together. My son Jalen is back home, and he finally got my ooh, ooh, ch -ch 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 -ch. my greenhouse has been fixed. It's together, yes indeed. And I've already put my some of my plants on it. I want to show you guys how big it is. So I'm like five seven. I'm almost five seven. I'm like uh, doctors say I'm five six and five eight. Almost exactly five seven inches. So five seven. I say five seven, right? And so that's how tall it is. So I'm taller than this side, but I'm exactly, if you saw it to the center, center of this, um, I'm about the same height, right? Um, so it's, it's a mini small, it's a small because they have bigger than this and wider than this, but I'm giving you a better perspective. Check this out. If you can see that it's four, it's a four, um, tier, um, so four levels, four tiers, and here, so like one, that's one space, two space, three space, four space, right? Bottom part right here, and it comes with um, rollers, so I can roll this baby if I choose to. I really don't want to roll it because I got, uh, I only spent $31 on this. I should have probably got two, but I wasn't sure if it's going to be very, very cheap. So once I... Um, it's inside right now, inside my house. The goal is to put it on the patio because this baby comes with a cover. Now this cover will protect it from rain if you can get a better perspective and it rolls up. But let me show you how I can unroll it when I'm done. We go here, let's see here, we're gonna, okay. And it rolls all the way down. Look at that, zip. So it's not as cheap as $31. It's pretty good for $31. With tax, I think it wasn't more than $35, bucks, I'll tell you that. Okay, and so I can, how I keep it, it'll be rolled up because, you know. But look at this. This is my pots of stuff that I just uh, did earlier today. So I have a bit, again, I've been in the garden all day playing the dirt. A fun fact, you guys, when I was younger, they called me Dirty Sally because mm -hmm, I love the dirt. I used to eat dirt. Mm -hmm. Me and my sister used to make uh, dirt pies. And then when I got to Alabama, red dirt, oh my goodness, that Choctaw County type of dirt. Anyways, I digress. Old memories of eating dirt So I, and playing in dirt. I played in dirt all the time. So playing in my garden, I love it now. And I'm not fond of the worms that have been advised for me to put worms in my garden. And shout out to my gardener that told me to put the worms. I haven't done that yet. I'm, re I'm praying on that because 
I know it's supposed to take away the gnats. And um, I've been using some other stuff, and I'll show you guys, that'll be another video, what I've been using to take away the gnats. But anyways, fast forward to, uh, I'm not, have not put the worms in here. So it's just basically good soil. So the, the cocoa, um, cocoa um, peat, and the um, potting mix, and then the food. And so here, this is my romaine lettuce. If you can see that, I haven't labeled the other ones. This right here is my, you can go in there. So that's, this right here is my um, garlic, garlic bulbs. And this is my, this right here is the, the red bag. Remember the red bags? If you can see it probably better, this one. The red bag is simply uh, cabbage, red, purple cabbage. Can you go in there and see that? Oh, there it is, okay. So I got two red bags. I got two purple cabbages, two purple cabbage, some garlic, and there's another a tray of garlic, and I haven't put anything at the bottom. Oh, and these are my green onions, right? Those are the green onions. So you guys that are looking for greenhouses, um, this is basically for the house, or I'm gonna take it to the patio area. It's kind of lit over that way, so you can't really, if you can, in the patio, um, outside it's dark, remember it's late. It'll go outside on my patio area. I'll show you guys that in the morning. I think I showed a video of um, the space that I'm gonna put it on the wall, and that's why I made sure that it was gonna be, um, that it's covered. Um, but a lot of my little stuff, for my tomatoes that are growing beautifully, and oh, oh, you know what? I haven't put the potato. This is the sweet potato. I guess I can put the sweet potato in there too. That'll be something. I got the sweet potato. And then I didn't guys show you guys this. The, oh, I did show you. I did a thing about peppers. It's the mini peppers. This is mini peppers This in, in this little pot. And the white onions. I got another white onion here. Okay. And of course I got some some uh, um, collard greens down here that I'm gonna be, that I gotta waste to that stems, right? That's got a stem. But let me show you another fun fact about, look at this. This right here, baby, is a yellow bell pepper, but I put a slice, a little piece of a, you see that, of a red onion, a purple onion, and look at it, it's already growing. Just the, that's the center of the onion that wasn't even a whole onion and it's growing where my bell peppers um live right isn't that amazing um you know what also you guys i didn't show you this but i have a mango a mango fruit here okay let me see if i turn the light on okay okay right here is my mango that's gonna be a mango fruit tree in this little pot right here and so right in between the um, um, mini peppers and my onions that is a white one white onion and I got another big white onion here that's already growing stems in the mason jar here at the back look at that right I'm gonna transplant that, that's gonna go in there, right? Oh my goodness. It's coming along, you guys, it's coming along, the scraps. I, didn't, I don't know if I showed you guys this, but check this out. I have a cauliflower that I'm gonna be doing next. I have a cauliflower, here we go, look at that. This is a cauliflower, take it under the light a little. Oh, let's take it over here, so you can see this better, okay? That's with the cauliflower. I cut this down and some cauliflower. And that's going to be my next thing. Look, that one little root right here. Look at that. This one little root. Look a little closer. Right there. That's going to be next. And that's going to go on here. Woohoo! Yes, woo -hoo. To my greenhouse. Welcome to my greenhouse. Greenhouse. Look at that. How beautiful. Another perspective, you guys. Another perspective of a mini 
mini greenhouse. So you guys that want to put these outside, you can use this, but you might want to bolt it down, right? Because it comes on wheels. Look at that. It comes on wheels. And it will roll, but to me, it's too wobbly. It's a little wobbly to be trying to roll it. I figure that, uh, think of like when I used to do satellites, they call them fixed. So think of that. It's going to be fixed. Once it get into this, once I put it on the patio, it's going to stay there. And I can take and go visit it. I can take the cover. Look at this. And it will close and it zips. Look how nice. That, that's beautiful. This is just a protector from any, from bugs, you know. Um, the bottom part, maybe I have to do something else to put a, I'll probably put something at the bottom of it, but all the way around it, look. Take you better back, check this out. It's covered all the way around. So check that out. The hole, the only thing that's not really covered is down at the bottom. I just noticed that. Noticed. So that'll be part two. I'll probably show you guys what I'll do with that. All right, you guys, invest in a mini greenhouse. If in your apartment, you are working with an apartment, you really don't need it. But my little small little space, my little space of gardening right there, you know, I wanted to use my, utilize my patio area. And it's because it's winter time now and it's starting to get cold, I want to make sure that I have it covered when it rains. And hey, you guys, when it do rain, collect some of that rain water. It's good for your plants. All right, you guys, have a wonderful night.